Hey Glam Dolls. So it is insanely early in the morning. I just got through doing my makeup. And if any of you is interested in this eye look that I did create for the day, then be sure to check down in the description box below because I already got a video up sharing with you how I achieved this eye look. And um, I'm going to be vlogging today because I have some errands that I'm going to be running and, you know, doing a little bit of shopping, which is going to be fun. And I was like, it'll be a good day, you know, to take them along with me. So right now I'm just prepping my hair for my wig. This is my uh, natural hair. I do have quite a few natural hair videos that I will be sure also to link down in the description box below. And if you happen to be streaming this, then at the end of this video, you will see both videos uh, showing this makeup look and more information about my natural hair care. All right, enough of me rambling on this intro. Let me get my day together so I can set the tone and I'll see y'all when I'm ready to go out the door. Okay, so I am ready. I am ready. I'm together. I'm just packing my bag. Uh, I decided to put on all black today. Oh, my shoes. These are super cute. Let me show them to you. These are the shoes I'm wearing today. Super cute. They flats because, you know, shopping. I don't want to wear no heels. Uh, my accessories will be these glasses right here. Okay. I'm wearing these glasses today and my nails are done and uh oh my nails these are the nails i decided to go with for today i already have a video down in the description box below sharing with you all you know my artificial nail addiction um i'm just gonna quickly apply my miss glamour Attic cosmetics basic nude lippy a lot of you have you know inquired when is it coming out when is it coming out it's coming. I told you before, uh, if, well, if you're a newbie passing through, you see me for the very first time. Um, be careful. Okay, you see me for the very first time. I'm launching my own cosmetic line and I'm doing it without any collaborations, no sponsors, no major brands backing me or using my likeliness and image. I'm doing it with my own coin and it's taken, uh, you know, a lot longer than expected because my money is a little bit shorter than I expected. So, yeah. I'm just trying some lip gloss over it. Uh, anyhow. Done. This is the bag that I'm carrying for the day. My Givenchy bag. And uh, now I just need a fragrance to set the tone. And if you're an official glam doll, you know my other obsession with smell good. So I'm gonna go with, um, since I'm wearing all black, I'm gonna go with Classic Madame. Classic Madame, I purchased this from my local Rainbow. This is a dupe for Chanel Mademoiselle Intense. So yeah, this is intense. Oh God. Some goes, don't rub your wrist when you spray your perfumes. That's how I apply it. There's no rules to this, okay? There's no rules to this. Spray my wig, because you know, gotta spray my wig. That. And, uh, get my bag. Put on my jacket. And let's go. Okay, dolls, I just got off the train. I'm at 34th Street. You gotta see me on going. I'm walking down the steps. So, 34th Street garden here which is home of the Knicks that the hubs is rocking their jacket so I'm just walking through the subway tunnel as soon as I get above ground I'll come right back to you First 
stop is going to be Macy's. We're going to go in Macy's. I want to check out um, a new bedroom set that I kind of have my eye on. So, you dolls, comment down below. Share your thoughts with me about this bedroom set. There's two of them that I'm going to show you. And uh, New York City is so proud. Look at this. issues I'm not gonna record in here for too too much because I can't afford to get the audio recorded on my channel so let me get upstairs to the uh, furniture section so I can show y'all these two bedroom sets but first he wants to look at this jacket over here what jacket is this who's this Ed Hardy Nice. Oh, that matched your pants you got on this one. Yeah, it matches. Looks like it's a set. Who's that one? Okay, doll, so tell me what do y'all think? I mean, this is super cute. I'm considering doing all the pieces. So this is like the credenza. That's the credenza. You know, the tall mirror. We gotta have a tall mirror. Matter of fact, let's do an outfit of the day. <laughs> Those are the shoes that I decided to wear. Those are my shoes. Super cute. Anyhow, this is the outfit of the day. And um, this is the credenza, the tall mirror, the two nightstands, and the bed. Of course, the bed, I would do a king size, king size bed. But what do y'all think? This is in Macy's. I even like the lamps. I even like the daggone plant. Yeah, how much is this bed? That's not bad. Queen is only $9.99. That's the bed by itself without the mattress. It's $9.99. Or I was thinking maybe this set right here too. You know? Those are my bags on the bed. <laughs> I went to Lord and Taylor and Sephora and stuff, but I don't know. Should we do this? Or should I do that? I think I'm going to do that. Yeah. Anyway, let me get my shopping bags because I need to go down to the perfume counter so we can see what else they got. Let's go. Okay, so that was the bedroom sets that I was looking at. I showed both of them to the hubs. That's Rev. You see he's on the phone. I showed both of them to him and um, no, 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 he didn't give me his feedback just yet. So let me get downstairs and let's see what new smell goods I can find. Sorry dolls, I gotta do a voiceover because of copyright infringement issues. The music was way too loud downstairs in Macy's. However, I am by the Juicy Couture counter. As you can see, the Wii perfume that I showed you in a previous video. So once I finished with Juicy Couture, you know I had to go by my Christian Dior, my Ja Adore, loves that brand to death, oh my gosh. But anyhow, they have a new men's fragrance that's out on the market, and I wanted Rev to smell it, that's the hubs. And when I did, 
he didn't really care for it so that was kind of a buzz but that's okay i still went browsing to see what other fragrances are new on the market and then i just started thinking to myself this is what i love about shopping in Mason. it comes to the service can use a little bit of work but it makes up for the vast variety of selections that i have to choose from i feel like i'm in perfume heaven right now but as many of you glam dolls know especially if you are an official glam doll which means you are a subscribed glam doll which also means you already know my obsession with smell goods i mean my name should be miss perfume at So I finally found the Michael Kors counter, but did you see what I meant by how loud the music is in Macy's and the copyright infringement issues that I would have had? So anyhow, Michael Kors had a great special going on. They was giving out some free tote bags with a purchase of a gift set. And what I also loved about the Michael Kors counter is they offered to engrave the bottle with my actual name on it. I thought that was super cute. But needless to say, I then went over to Chanel and you know I had to go see what they now have going. And they have a fragrance called Gabrielle, which I do intend on buying. From there, I stopped by Joe Malone. I never heard of this fragrance before, so I was definitely intrigued by it. And the woman here was so helpful. She explained the whole origin to it and how it all started in London and it was imported over to the U.S. And she gave me the whole history of Joe Malone so I definitely do intend on trying out a few of their fragrances because I did come across two of them that I did like that I would like to share with y'all in another video so once I finished learning about the origin of Joe Malone fragrances I then head on over to skincare omg they have this wonderful wonderful serum that is new on the market and you know me you know glam anything that is anti-aging promising to turn back the hands of time you know i'm gonna be all over it and this gentleman here was so knowledgeable and sadly i do not remember his name and i was trying to listen closely in on my audio to see if i can capture it but the music was so loud that my audio didn't pick it up but if you happen to see this gentleman right here omg you must see him he is like the skincare plug and he has over 35 years of skincare experience in the business and his energy was so wonderful so positive and sir if you happen to be watching this video i definitely look forward into running into you again so once i finished with skincare i went leaving the store but then i came across this young lady here and omg she is like my new bff but instead of me telling you all about her i'm gonna let the audio play try to listen closely because i have to add music over it and um take a listen to this hey dolls this is michelle <laughs> So sorry to jump back in on a voiceover, but the audio in Macy's is absolutely horrible for recording. I mean, oh my gosh. But anyhow, this young lady right here, get a good look at her because you have to see her if you ever is in Macy's Herald Square shopping for new fragrances. And you know why? Matter of fact, I'm going to let you hear why you got to see her. You gotta come see her. Absolutely. She, she won't take good care of you. She, she just showed me something on a whole nother level. Absolutely. I'm a brand ambassador for Cole. This is what she works in. She's a little boss. Black boss. Oh my god, Burberry. Ooh, she's the perfume one. She's the perfume Hey, dog. 